Hello again, everybody. This is Coach Frank Baserick, and we are going to stay in the infield today doing some base defense and also seeing it uh, in action as well as I can make it happen. Um, so let's take a look at today. Today we're looking at runners at first and second. We'll look at it hitting the ball to the right side of the field or mostly second base and to the left side of the field, which is shortstop. Um, if the ball is hit to the first baseman on the right side of the infield, um, then make sure the pitcher is covering first base. Uh, anything hit to the right side there, the pitcher probably should be going over and covering first base. Now, let's take a quick look um, at what we're talking about. So the ball is hit to the right side of the infield. We always want to try to get the lead runner. It is more difficult when you have a runner on second base and the ball's hit to the right side unless you get to the ball quickly set yourself and make a good throw but that's what we want to do if we can the shortstop um, will try to get a double play if it has to go to second if that runner gets a good lead and somebody tells the second baseman just to go to second well then let's do that and you try to get the double play but again you're going to try to get them at third base now depending on the level that you're at you might want to change um, how you want your players to go at lower levels you're probably just going to try to get uh, the out closest to second or first the better your players get then you definitely are trying to cut that runner off at third base so utilize this and what works for you make sure you speak to your coaches and find out uh, what their uh, particular um plan is or how they want it to run now remember everybody is moving you're either ball base or backup in every scenario when you're out on the field so let's take a look at this again we have runner on first we have a runner on second in this scenario the ball is going to be hit to the second baseman on the right side of the field so the second baseman will be on ball he's going to field the ball short stops on base first is on base third covers base the pitcher uh, in this scenario, since we have a runner on second base, is going to have to come and back up third unless your coach wants you to have that individual coming over and cover in first base. Now, if the ball is hit almost in this hole, that first baseman has to drag over. Pitcher has to go the other way and take first base. So you got to pay attention. Okay. Um, Again, there's no perfect for, perfect scenarios for these. The ball's hit and ball bounces in crazy ways. Catcher covers home. The right fielder is going to back up to the first base side. Center field is going to sprint over and back up the second baseman in case the ball gets by him. Left fielder is backing up a throw that could possibly come to the shortstop or over here to the third base area. I would say, depending on the level you're at, if you are in a lower level where you're not going to be able to probably get that lead runner in most cases, left fielder has to come over here and cover a throw to second base and back up there. If not, you're at higher levels, and we're definitely trying to cut that run off. Left fielder needs to come over here and cover this area behind third base because, again, the throw will be coming this way. All right? And then our throw will come to second or third, and we'll try to knock them off. Now, this particular scenario we're showing here is more for the, I would say, up to 14 age level, where they are not as good defensively yet in most cases. Um, so we're, they're normally going to try to cut the runner at second and double off the player at first. So let's take a look at this in action and see it live. Uh, the pitch is going to come in. The batter hits the ball out to second base. Second baseman's on ball. Shortstop first and third on base. The pitcher in this scenario is backing up third base just in case. Runners move. Ball goes to first base to double them off. Right fielder is, is backing up first base on that throw coming back to first. Let's watch it one more time. Ball comes in. Ball's hit to the right field or excuse me, second base, second base cover, shortstop first and third on base, pitcher on backup, catcher on base, right field, center field, and left field all are backing up where a ball is either hit or might be thrown. Get the runner out at second and try to get the runner out at first. If we double them off, 
then we're not worried about that runner at third. However, if that ball goes to second, you have to be listening, and catcher will tell you if you need to throw that ball home because you might have to cut that runner off from third or from second, rounding third, coming home. All right, let's move to the next scenario. This one's hit to the left side. The left side, it's a heck of a lot easier, even for lower levels. You want to try to cut that runner off from second to third for sure because we do not want to get the scenario where that individual is going to score. So remember that. If the ball, though, is hit to the right side of the shortstop, so here's a shortstop. If it's your right side, you definitely have to go to third base. If it's hit to the left side or closer to the second base bag, if you don't have a very good shortstop or or you have a newer one, not as skilled yet, that shortstop has to go to second base, either take it himself or throw it to second and try to get the double play. So let's take a look at this one in action. And again, this is runners on first and second, and the ball hits to the left side of the field or the shortstop in this Scenario, the pitch comes in, the ball's hit to the shortstop. The shortstop covers ball, third base is on bag, second base on bag, first base on bag. The pitcher backs up, left fielder and center fielder's backing up. And as you can see, we got the runner at third base in the throw. And so we got that, and then we'll come back to second if we can double play him. If that is the, um, the best option for you make sure you're listening because your players or definitely your catcher should be letting you know what to do with the ball let's take one more quick look at this um so here we go in motion ball comes in the ball's hit goes out to shortstop the runners break for third shortstops on ball third second first are on base the pitcher's in backup right field's in backup center field left fielder is in backup position the catcher's telling them what to do they throw it to third get them out there or she and then look to either double them off at first or second. I bet you know you w really want to pay attention to not throwing behind a runner. So if you get the guy at third, the one running to second uh, is the one you want to try to get. If you throw it all the way to first base, then that he's going to advance to third or she. All right. So. Now, in the same scenario, we're hitting the ball to the pitcher. So it's coming up the middle of the pitcher. We have runners on first and second, and we are going to want to run our play um, from there and see how it works in motion. Again, going to the pitcher. So the pitch comes in. The hitter hits the ball. Third, second, and first are covering bags. Shortstop's on uh, back, back up. Center fielder, left fielder, right fielder on backup. The pitcher fielded the ball, threw it to third, and got the lead runner. Let's take one more look at this. The pitch comes in. The hit goes to the pitcher. Third covers bag. Shortstop's backing up. Second and first are on bag. Catcher's on bag. Pitcher fields the ball. Right fielder, center fielder, and left fielders are backup. We throw the runner out at third and look to see if we can double them off at second. So pretty simple there. Think in your head, if I'm getting the ball, where am I going? And are you ball, base, or backup? I hope everybody uh, understood these videos. Uh, I, sometimes we go a little bit fast. If you're in our program, uh, you're learning this, um, and you can ask coaches questions, of course. If you're not in our program, make sure you speak with your coaches, either baseball or softball, and see how they want to play this. But this is uh, the initial basic for runners on first and second to the right side, the left side of the field, or the pitcher. I hope everybody has a great day. Remember to play hard, play fast, and have fun.